this is the one to watch. Roman Dumas, who twice before has been the top man here in the hill climb. Can he take a third win of the hill climb shootout? Well, I'm Roman Dumas, I'm from France. I have the chance to drive the Supervan 4.2. That is an evolution of the one we are using two years ago here. So, uh, yeah, we'll see how fast it is. Power train is uh, 2,000 horsepower for 1,700 kilo. So as you can imagine, it's, it's quite powerful. As you can see, it's a transit, so quite big. So the road is quite narrow, so I have to find a way to, to drive it as fast as possible. Well, a lot of evolution. First of all, you know, when we drove it in 2022 was exactly the first time I had a chance to drive the Supervan. We just done a rollout the day before to arrive in Goodwood. So for sure, it was really the start of this crazy project. And uh, since that, you saw we have many success. So this one has more downforce. For sure, we, are, we improve also in terms of drivability, braking, uh, how to use the power, and etc. So uh, yeah, we know more our, let's say, uh, my toy, let's say like that. And uh, for sure, normally it should be a little bit faster than two years ago. Well, you know, step by step, we are getting more and more really on a race car. We improve a lot after battles this year. The, our lap time record, we improve a lot the braking performance on our regeneration. For sure, chassis-wise, it's quite impressive because even if it's quite big, quite heavy, it's really reacting like a race car since day one. And I think this is really the positive point, you know, that Ford and Start Performance arrived really to create a car who react like a race car. So to drive it, it's a lot of fun. No, at the end of the day, uh, you know, everybody has his own opinion for sure, but uh, we have to think that at Ford, anyway, the target is to have an EV car because now this car also on the road car, so uh, this is clear. At the end of the day, still a combustion engine, very small, I'm sure can be also very fast. Right. Do you think it suits the hill? <laughs> <laughs> well, for sure, the, some corner, yes, some corner for sure. It's a little bit narrow. But exactly, this is for sure the hardest part, and you know that you don't have to do mistake. You know, I'm sure that all around the world, everybody is looking this van. You know, and uh, everybody is looking at it and say which kind of lap time you can do, so you don't want to do any mistake also. What was it like saying a record in it? Oh, it was very nice. I mean, it was uh, quite impressive. We are there for. You know, we didn't expect to go so fast and uh, for sure just a little bit earlier, the Mercedes was faster than we expected. So we have really to squeeze everything out of it and to push also to our limit, also my limit. And the last lap was, uh, yeah, on the edge. It was quite funny actually to, you know, to push also yourself to do this kind of lap time and to play really with the limit of the world, you know, with such a, uh, an impressive car in terms of for sure on, of size and power. But, uh, it was really demanding, also top speed was very impressive. So uh, yeah, it was, it was a big challenge, I have to say. Well, you know, you cannot compare the concept. The idea was a prototype, you know, for sure. Electric prototype, really, with a carbon chassis, very, very, I mean, like a Le Mans car, more or less. But here, we, ha we have to, to, to see that we are respecting the idea to have a transit or a, 150 truck. So at the end of the day, it's completely different, you know, in terms of mentality. Uh, the idea was really done to beat the Pikes Peak record. Uh, here, you know, in Pikes Peak, we never run the, for the unlimited class. We always run in time attack. So uh, it's completely different. So yeah, it's, it's a different concept. You know, one of the best events. I mean, anyway, good with both events, the revival of Festival Speed are one of the best moments of the year when you are a driver to see so many nice cars and spectator. You have people from all around the world. And if they are coming from so far, you know why, because it's uh, one of the best events. So we are lucky to be here. Here we go, the one last driver that can beat Scott Speed, Roman Dumas, who actually set the fastest time yesterday, a 45 dead was his time. Uh, Scott Speed's gonna know uh, from being up the top that he is the fastest at the moment. He's gotta sit and wait patiently, a nervous wait for Scott. There is 2,000 horsepower 
in that Ford Supervan. It's got four electric motors. Away we go. Right, this is the one to watch. Roman Dumas, who twice before has been the top man here in the hill climb. Can he take a third win of the hill climb shootout? He's got to keep it tidy. He's got to use all of that speed and power. It was a good getaway. 4.4 seconds. It's going well. Yeah, it's going very well. It flies through, uh, kicks up all the dust. He uses all the amount of road. This is going to be so close. They are neck and neck, Ben. Wow, this is going to be tight. Can he do it? Can he beat Scott Speed? Is it going to be the Ford Superman or will it be the Subaru that has taken the victory? Roman Dumas doing everything to try and get across the line a fraction faster. Over the line he goes and it's 43.98. He's done it. He's done it. 43.99 in the end when it's worked out. Roman Dumas takes his third win at the Goodwood Hill Climb on the yeah, Festival of Speed. Uh, that was so and fun. Scott Speed has to settle for second place. Roman Dumas really did it there, and that was a, a fabulous time, wasn't it? Absolutely fabulous. He casually just slackens his belts there as if, uh, yeah, that was just a casual drive up the hill. Looks so chill, but wow, so impressive. Roman, that was unbelievable. How do you feel? Well, I don't know if it was unbelievable, but uh, yeah, two corners to the end, I was quite close to the wall. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I was pushing quite hard, I have to say. Yeah, a lot of fun again, like always, you know, in this kind of, uh, I mean, good wood is just amazing. It's a 40 second, but very intense, as you can see with the, with the Ford. I mean, it's quite impressive to go at this speed through uh, <laughs> this small field, but uh, again, a lot of fun. I told you yesterday, I will push at the final, so. I'm quite happy that uh, we won it. It's good. <laughs> well, you certainly did. And did you have any idea how fast Scott had gone on his run? No, not at all. Uh, for sure, I knew, I saw that they are very motivated, you know, uh, very good that uh, we have competition at this level. I mean, unfortunately, it was many crash, but many crash also sh shows that everybody is pushing to the limit. And I think, you know, we are also happy to be here at the end of the day. We all want to win. That's, uh, that's competition. And it's for fun. But uh, he proved again this year that we are all, I mean, sending everything for the last final run. And it was very good. Well, everybody does want that crown. And you had to pull out the fastest time you've done all weekend in order to beat Scott, which you did. Uh, we're going to put the run up on the screen for you there to have a look at. And if you could talk us through how it went for you. Well, the first corner, you know, is very difficult always because you have to judge the grip. So second corner here is quite tricky because we have so much power that the traction is always difficult to, to put on the ground. For sure, this corner at the end of the straight is always uh, the hardest one because you see people are doing mistakes here. So I took it a little bit carefully. But for sure, from this point on, you know, we have quite a lot of downforce. I knew that I really need to push at this point. And uh, yeah, it was, was good. I mean, the, the next one was uh, for me the most uh, scary one. In exit here, I lost a little bit the car quite close to the wall. But it was okay. I mean, a lot of fun, like always. Yeah. It certainly looked fun. Um, His Grace now has, has the prize. Congratulations. Well done, mate. Thank you Great. Yeah. Thank you. Thank You're a star here. Oh, well, I don't know if I'm a star, yeah, but. Uh, fantastic. Which was the best? It was, a, it, was a, it, was a, it was a brilliant drive. It thank looked you, sensational. Thank you, thank you, thank <laughs> yeah, you for well everything done. again. Well done. Thank well you. Done. So I think we have to drink now, right? I think you're allowed to. I think I you've earned it. 40 seconds, but you know, it's a good excuse, right? <laughs> you've earned every drop. Thank you. Our champion 2024, Roman Duma in the super van. So yeah, I need to find some people to spray the champagne right now. So I don't know yeah, who is interested. except for me. Yeah, why, why that? <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.